Jim Bass Cars and Trucks. And welcome back, everybody, looking at our six-hour time lapse. We did have a few clouds pushing through earlier this morning, otherwise plenty of sunshine for our morning and then getting into our afternoon. Very similar to what we had yesterday. Those clouds are starting to build up a little bit. Looking at our current conditions right now, we have 90 degrees in San Angelo. Humidity is down to 48%, and winds are relatively calm, maybe coming in from the south one or two miles an hour and temperatures around the rest of the region here we've got a lot of mid to upper 80s and then a few areas like around san angelo robert lee bellinger and coleman are hitting the low 90s at this time wind speeds like i said they're more on the calm side with the exception big lake actually has nine mile an hour winds coming in from the south at this time around the rest of the lone star state we do have temperatures sitting a lot of 80s even a bit into the 90s for the north and eastern portions of texas Texas at this time, although it's not too bad. Still a little bit on the cooler side. We don't have a whole lot of activity going on for the state. We do have maybe a few spotty showers along the coastline there, but otherwise the rest of the uh, Texas is going to continue to be pretty much in the clear. Not a whole lot of activity even for the Concho Valley region. Now as we get through the rest of our day here, we are going to see partly cloudy skies throughout the rest of the afternoon. Winds will shift coming in from the east at 5 to 10 miles per hour. And our highs are going to be, once again, low to mid-90s as we get through our Friday here. Now as we continue getting into tonight, we're expecting lows to be in the low to mid-70s with a decrease in cloud cover. And tomorrow we're going to see highs hitting mid to upper 90s as we start off into this weekend. We'll have a mix of sun and clouds as well. And for downtown movie night, Tonight's movie is going to be Frozen 2. We are going to see pretty much average temperatures and calm winds with those clearing skies. We're looking at temperature decreasing to the mid-80s as we get closer to the start for the movie tonight. And like I said, we'll have a few clouds still lingering as we continue getting through our evening hours. Breaking down the rest of our 7 day forecast here, we're going to see those upper 90s, so it's not going to be quite as warm as we initially anticipated earlier this week for the weekend. Showers are going to start coming in Sunday night, and then we're going to have widespread showers across the Concho Valley as we get into the middle of this next week. A cooling trend will also bring us down to the mid-80s as we get into Thursday of next week. And once again, we're we'll continue to see plenty of clouds, especially for Wednesday and Thursday, scattered showers across the region, and we're going to continue to monitor those particular days as we get closer into next week. You're watching KLST News at Noon. We'll be right back after this break.